So now I'm gonna give you a tour of the, of the machine and a startup of the machine. Um, on this side, you've got your wire feeder that holds your wire, uh, holds a 15 pound roll, uh, stainless steel wire or aluminum wire. It's got dual drivers for, you know, performance. That way it doesn't, you know, slip on you or anything. And it's got extra rollers for different size wire. Uh, right now I have a 035 in there, but you can go up to uh, 1.2 millimeter and 1.6 millimeter, which is uh, roughly about um, 045 and up. And on this side, you have storage for anything that you would like to put in here. Right now we have our hood in there. Um, lenses, cables, uh, regulator. That will come with your kit. Start it up. You've got this key. Turn it on, make sure your emergency stops off. Have it boot up. You want to turn your chiller power on first, and then your laser power. And then down here, you'll want to push on. Make sure that blue light's on. Once it gets up to operating temp, which is around 20 to 25 Celsius, um, if you're in a colder area, it might actually need to warm up to 25 to 20 uh, degrees Celsius. And if that is the case that you are in a colder area, you will want to put at least a gallon of RV antifreeze in there. Now you have your laser welding wire feeder uh, aspect of the machine. Um, this can go up to 100 millimeters a second, down to five millimeters a second. And it has a uh, retract speed, retract distance, delay feeling, filling, uh, filling distance, and millisecond delay feeding. Delay feeding. Um, you've got wire feed that will push your wire out of your gun. You got wire retract that will retract the wire from your gun. And this is also another button that you can use that does the same thing as this one. Now on your panel, your control panel, you have your laser power, laser frequency, duty cycle, pattern, wobble frequency, and wobble size. Then you also have this locking mechanism so nobody can come over here and mess with your settings. Turn that lock off and you can start changing your settings. To turn on your laser is a simple switch. Laser on. Wire feeding on. Make sure you got gas. And your pulse mode, scale mode. You have presets. If you want a rough estimate on the gauge of the material, the type of material, just like any other uh, welding machine, it'll give you the welding power, your frequency, your uh, wire speed, wobble frequency, feeding speed, recommended wire diameter, but like most cases, uh, you'll more than likely stick to one uh, size wire. And this is also with your uh, type of material. So you got stainless steel, 
aluminum and mild steel. It also gives you the option to save a preset. So let's say your 14 um, preset, you like it at, you know, 1200. Oh. Like it at a thousand, sorry. Uh, 2500 hertz. 100% duty cycle. 25 wobble frequency. And a 2.5 wobble size. Save it. Now let's say you go back to aluminum. We'll go to preset five. Now you have your aluminum setting. You come back to your, let's say this is stainless steel. Now you're going back to your stainless steel setting. Now if you make a, an adjustment, say you actually like 3000 Hertz, hit save and you're saved into that preset. Go back to your aluminum, it's changed. Go back to your stainless steel setting and your 3000 Hertz is saved. 